motivation to anybody out there to post that content. You ain't been batch creating, you're missing out. But if you do know, hey, welcome back to my channel. Y'all already know who it is, or you should know who it is. The CEO -O 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 of Ice Tasty and I am back with another video. If you're new here, go ahead and hit that subscribe button, okay? You're gonna love it here. I upload several times a week, whether it's business tip videos, vlogs, behind the scenes of entrepreneurship. I do it all. Everybody, please like, comment, and subscribe. And as y'all can probably tell from the title, today is content day. So today is Sunday, November 12th. I plan today to lock myself in the house and get to work. So stay tuned to watch the behind the scenes of my content creating day process as an entrepreneur and a content creator as well. Not only... And I am a content creator for my business page. I'm also a content creator for my personal page. I built a personal brand, Rika underscore forever, which is my TikTok and my Instagram. My y'all, when I say I'm so proud of myself, this is motivation to anybody out there to post that content. Can y'all believe that on my personal page, I have reached over 2 million people within the last, I don't even have 2 million followers. I just hit 123K, but the fact that we're about to hit 124K, so be sure to follow. Don't be a lurker, don't be a hater, go follow if you love pink. But the fact that I reached over 2 million people from my posting is crazy. Post that content, you guys. Post, post, post. Stop worrying about what people will think. Stop worrying about people that you know they are not going to like. Just keep post, 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 post. So, I actually started late, y'all. It's actually 1.37 p.m., but that's because I went to bed at 3 a.m. So, I told myself I was going to give myself a break. I set no alarms, and I woke up. I don't even know when I woke up because I naturally wake up around like 9, 10 ish. So I did wake up, but I didn't check my phone or anything. I just forced myself to go back to sleep. And the next time that I woke up, it was after 11. So I was like, okay, yeah, we getting up now. So I took the time to do my makeup, start laundry. I'm doing laundry. It's also a Sunday reset day. So we're going to clean the house today. But I have so much content to record. As far as my business page is concerned, I am a U.S. cosmetic wholesaler. So if you are interested in starting a cosmetic business, I have everything you need. I have lashes. I have lip glosses, lip oils, lip liners, eyeliner, mascara. I have everything that you need. So today I'm going to be creating content for my business page and my goal. I'm going to write everything down. So right now we're about to write down everything that I'm going to do. If you guys do want a more detailed content batch creating day, please comment batch creating in the comment section. So I know that you guys are interested in that video. I am going to show you guys how I batch create, but this video is not going to be as long, mainly because if I sit here talking to you guys, I'm not going to get my work done and it's already almost two o'clock. So I'm going to show you guys some of the behind the scenes. And if you do want a dedicated video, just comment batch creation down below. And it's very, very important that you batch create your content if you are a entrepreneur, because especially when it comes to working a nine to five, I did not quit my nine to five until last year. So throughout my whole business journey, the four plus years that I've been in business, I was working my nine to five and going to school full-time the entire time. So time management as an entrepreneur is very, very important. People always like, do you have an assistant? How are you able to get all of these things done? Because now I'm posting on my personal page, my business page. I run all of these platforms by myself. Time management is very, very important. So I'm going to be um, working on content because my goal for today is to have a week's worth of content. Black Friday is literally around the corner. And by the way, for Black Friday, I'm giving away 100 pairs of lashes. So make sure you stay tuned for the giveaways, y'all. I'm, give I'm doing giveaways all week, <laughs> all weekend. So Black Friday, I'm giving away 100 pairs of lashes and gift cards. On Saturday, I'm doing special giveaways with my collab stuff. On Sunday, y'all, just stay tuned. Stay tuned. Make sure you're following my business Instagram, I Tasty, because that is where you will be entering the giveaway. There is nothing extra you have to do for the giveaway but shop. Literally, just shop and comment your order number because in the comments, that's how I pick the winner. I have an app that generates the winner through the comment section, so I'm not sitting here typing each person. So all you have to do is shop and comment your order number. You don't have to tag to your store. You don't have to do nothing extra. So stay tuned for that. If you are interested in winning 100 pairs of lashes, I can't wait to see who win it because whoever wins it 
you can resell those lashes. If you resell those lashes at $5, that's $500. $10, that's $1,000 you made off 100 pairs of lashes you got for free, okay? And then your Black Friday order will basically be free and profit because you won 100 pairs of lashes and you're able to make $1,000 off of it, okay? So this stuff keeps making noise, but this is just, okay, so this is the journal that I'm going to be using to plan out my content. This is my thoughts of a boss babe journal that just dropped. So if you have not copped it and you need a journal, definitely get one. I have three different ones, but this one is specifically called thoughts of a boss babe, because as y'all see, I write down my thoughts and ideas. So I know I'm going to run through this one quick. So I'm just going to write at the top real content because all the content i'm doing today is video content so i tasty i'm just gonna write at the top i tasty content so i just put that at the top and now i'm gonna think about all of the real ideas and this is literally business one-on-one -on -one, you guys free tips because when you create your content this way it makes it so much easier versus you coming and saying what should i record a video of or say you have an idea i want to do a video of me trying on lip glosses you try on the lip glosses and then it's like okay what now what do i record i don't have nothing to record so i find that when i make a list my content creation process consists of three steps so I'm going to, you can do it interchangeable. And we also talk about this in my Patreon, which is my group mentoring. So if you are interested in joining that, book a call or purchase a ebook. So talk about this in my Patreon, which is my exclusive group mentoring. So if you are interested in joining, you're a business owner and you need some more help and guidance, you have questions, I go live every single week in there via Zoom to answer questions. But there are requirements. You do have to have either purchased a ebook from me or booked a phone call. So if you know you've purchased the ebook from me and you want to join it, it is $30 a month, which is what, five, six, seven dollars a week basically six seven dollar a week webinars that you can ask me whatever questions you want to ask me via zoom for seven dollars and i upload tips throughout the week okay but anyways you guys so for one of my content ideas i know that i have to record this so this is basically um these are basically different tube options because again i am a cosmetic wholesaler start your business today link in the description box so these are all the different tubes that I have available for wholesale. So I know I want to do a video on tubes, like different tubes. So I'm just going to say different tube options. So that's one of the videos that I need to record. And it's not going to be no complicated video. It's just me literally showing like, you know, the different tubes that I have available for wholesale and explain all of that in the caption. So this is just like laying out so I know what to do. That's one video that I have to do. Another video that I'm going to do is a lip gloss lip liner swatch. So I'm going to write that down. Lip gloss slash liner swatch. Okay, that's option number two. So these are all different lip glosses that I'm going to be trying on today. But I do have to check them first because um my manufacturer did discontinue some colors so obviously i do not want to try on any color that is discontinued and show it when people cannot get it but i'm gonna show and what i like about these kinds of videos is you can literally do a video but you can repurpose that same video so let me know if you guys want the batch creating day video i'm super excited for that but I don't know if y'all want that kind of content. But I'll be, y'all, I'd be super excited to show you guys how people, because people tell me all the time, even people that book my calls, they'll be like, oh my God, like, I don't know what to post. And then once I sit there and I give, if you've ever booked my call before and I just sat here and give you ideas back to back, like even I had this lady book my call, which is in my boot camp for Black Friday. And she um, has a clothing storefront. She, if she watches, she knows who, I, who she is. But she has a storefront in the mall. And she also has a piercing shop. And I just gave her so many ideas for her clothing store as far as reels and content and stuff like that. And even she was like, oh my God, that's a good idea. It's like, girl, you have everything there to record. Like sometimes I feel like people overthink like, y'all, it's not that hard. You could do with what you have, okay? It's okay. Y'all y'all be forgetting that you can repurpose your content in so many different ways. That one video that you recorded, you could probably flip it three ways. Okay, 
So that's the second video I want to do regarding the lip gloss. Another video that I'm going to do is swatches, which is basically me opening up the lip glosses and swatching them. So I'm going to do a lip gloss swatch video. So right there, that is three video ideas that I just thought of. And of course, these three videos can be broken up into other video options okay so that's three pieces of content that i've already thought of three different reels so now when i start recording it's just back to back recording i'm checking off of a list so this is very very important you guys so when it so does come to lashes i do have my lashes on these trays already these are all of the different lash options that i have for anybody looking to start a lash business i have color lashes rhinestone rainbow butterfly so many different options so I kind of want to do different videos with different collections. Like I kind of want to do a video where I show all of my butterfly lash styles close up. So I'm going to put lashes now. So I'm going to do a butterfly lashes collection. And then I'm probably going to do... Um, I'm probably going to do maybe one showing each like each lash from a different collection. Like, I hope that makes sense. But y'all, if y'all wanna see the end results, it will be on my business Instagram, which is iTasty. But the end result will basically be like a rhinestone lash, a color lash, a glitter color, a 25 mm, like just showing each of the different lash collections that I have for wholesale. So I'm gonna do a wholesale collection, wholesale collection with one of each lash and then also you guys for i'm going back to the lip gloss because you know once you sit down and you actually start thinking of ideas more ideas will come so i'm when we go back to the lip gloss i'm actually going to do another video showing all the different lip gloss colors that i have like just showing the variety like i have all of these lip glosses for wholesale and then what else, what else, what else, what else, what else? So right now I already have one, two, three, four, five, six. So right now I've already compiled a list of six different content that I can post across all of my platforms. And I feel like I need to get more. But I know once I start recording, but I'm going to go ahead and start recording because six is already a lot. And like I told you, even though that's only six video ideas, I could stretch those six videos to 12. Trust it, okay? I, I could try, I could stretch those six videos to make them 12 videos. I know how to do that. So that's just the first part of my creating content. Well, actually, my first part is kind of saving sounds. But like I said, you can do it interchangeably, whether you're creating your list of ideas first and then you're finding sounds second. But like I told y'all, I don't know if I told y'all I was up till 3 a.m. because... I was working on content for my personal page because these collabs have been coming in like crazy. So I have officially done all of my paid collab content except my Lash Yen one, but that's gonna be a TikTok, but that's for my personal page. Right now I'm trying to focus on my business page because like I said yesterday, I was focusing on my personal page. I decorated my Christmas tree. So if you have not seen that video, definitely be sure to check it out. So I decorated my Christmas tree and went Christmas tree decor shopping and I basically recorded a whole bunch of pink content because my personal brand is pink. So I post pink content. So we about to get to this. I'm going to see y'all shortly. I'm going to put something on to watch and listen to. And like I said, if you guys are interested in seeing more of the behind the scenes of my content creating process, just let me know in the comments section, batch create, and I will have a video for y'all because y'all said y'all wanted to see the content creation process. So I'm showing you guys just a little.
Y'all, it's that Nova for me. So y'all, I'm still over here working on content. This is the lip gloss in the shade Nova with a brown lip liner. It's the perfect fall color. I just love how this color looks at me. When I first, when I started selling this color, I was like, like from looking at it, I was like, it's a bit too chocolate, chocolate, chocolate. But when you actually put it on, it's just like, but this is Nova, you guys. This is available for wholesale. You can get it in these tubes. You can get it in any of the tube options on the website for regular wholesale with no logo, or you could get it in a lip gloss bag if you want to put it in your tubes yourself, or you could get it in private label with your logo. So this one is Nova, you guys. So for my next lip combo, I'm probably going to change my shirt just because I don't want to make it look like it's in the same setting, same room. So I'm probably going to record those in my living room. And next, I'm going to be applying Luscious Red, which is the red shade. So and then I also still have to do swatches on my hands. So I'm trying to decide. Um, this is another dark color. This one is called Dark Souls. Yeah, I have so many colors. There's literally 30 lip gloss options to choose from. And the liquid lipsticks are dropping on Black Friday. So I'm super excited, which is why it's important for me to get all of this content done now. Because um, the lip the liquid lipstick should be in this upcoming week. But I know I have stuff to do this week. So that's why I need this whole week of content to just be pushed out like just straight products 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 because i have barely been posting my car when i tell y'all i have slacked this year like i've slacked tremendously so this year i'm just pushing out products three times a day you guys three times a day i'm gonna be pushing out products and then um that way next week i'm really either way it goes i'm not gonna start posting the liquid lipsticks until the week before black friday so let me check um which is next week because black actually that's this week oh hold up you guys this is the week before black friday so i'm probably not gonna start posting it till monday no way because i don't like to post new arrival stuff too early because then people are gonna keep asking about it so i'm going to wait until next week to post it so that's why i need all of this other content to be posting so that way people can already be seeing the different kinds of products that i have so that way they can start their business for black friday stock up on inventory for black friday so next like i said i'm probably going to do a red combo and i do want to use my um black lip pencil so i'm gonna do my black and clear combo which is something that i always usually do is a black lip liner with a clear lip gloss okay that's one of my favorite things to do from back in the day is doing that so i'm gonna do that i'm gonna do that before the red because y'all the red lip gloss where's my stand the red lip gloss is so pigmented it's so 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 pigmented and it's gonna take a minute for me to wipe it off my lips so i'm gonna go do those <laughs> i'm gonna do those two combos in my living room and i'm gonna change my time okay you guys so right now i am setting up as y'all can see my christmas tree is already up and done so if you have not seen that video definitely check it out after watching this one so right now i'm just gonna set up my ring light because like i told you guys i want to kind of give a different look i don't want it to give that i'm just sitting in the same spot recording over and over and over. that is what i'm doing of course but i just want to give it a different look so it doesn't get boring because i just feel like as a viewer it's, it's boring when you're just seeing somebody constantly post videos with the same outfit the same clothes and it just makes it look more obvious that it was recorded the same day so i do have on these super short shorts but they're not gonna see my bottoms, okay? They're just gonna see the top. So I just changed into this little crop. The fact that it's 4.30 and I've already gotten so much content done for my business page is amazing. Like, if you ain't been batch creating, you're missing out. But if you do work a nine to five, it kind of is hard. I used to batch create on my off days. So when I did work a nine to five, I did have to batch create on my off day. So you might just have to either do it in the evening, but of course it depends on what kind of schedule you work and stuff like that. And if you do need help with creating content, book a call on my website. I got you. I promise I will give you so many ideas. Like 
from just looking at your page and seeing what you saw, I will give you a list of ideas. So if you ever need my help when it comes to content and stuff, y'all book a call on my site and I got you. So right now I'm gonna do my dream bubble and lip liner combo. Once I finish all of this, um, what do I have to do? Because I've already edited, oh, I still gotta do my Shein collab. So that's probably the last thing I'm gonna do, but I still have to do like the swatches of the lip glosses. That's another video I have to record, but I'm gonna do that one back in my business room. So right now I'm gonna record as many lip gloss swatches as I can. And even if I change my shirt up, I will change my shirt up over here. When I get back to the room, I might go ahead and, um, no, I wanna do my Shein collab at the end because I know once I swatch the lip glosses, they're so pigmented, it's gonna stain my hand and I'm gonna have to wash my hands. So I'm gonna get all of this done first. Swatches, take lash, lash content. Y'all, I already have content scheduled all the way to Wednesday now, so. And it's only Sunday. And to be honest, y'all, I stopped scheduling on Instagram because I felt like when I started doing it months ago, or I wanna say last year, I think they brought the feature out last year. And when I tried it, and even the people that I asked that used it, they were like, it's not effective. They're not noticing that many views. But I guess that's because it was a new feature. So this week, I'm going to be experimenting with it. Like, I've been experimenting it with it here and there. But like I told y'all, when it comes to 2024, I'm really trying to live a very productive life. I'm really trying to have weeks worth of content scheduled and ready to go to where I don't even have to pick up my phone and do anything concerning my business is promoting itself for me. That's what I see for myself next year. So that's why I'm kind of trying to see what works for me now. And I feel like you guys should do that as well. If there's things you want to do next year, go ahead and start working on that now. Don't wait till next year. So that way now you can see what works for you, see what doesn't work for you, and you can prepare yourself for next year. Free tip right there, okay? So now we're gonna get into this video. Put some more lighting in here. Let's get into this video. Ooh, and I love that that picture is behind me. Or maybe I should do it this way. I think I'm gonna put myself this way. So that way I'm in between the two pictures and I do have on a pink shirt. So this is gonna be the I perfect. I tell y'all that today was such a productive day, y'all. It's 7.41 and I've gotten everything done that I needed to do. I've already organized orders and I'm about to show you guys the orders in a second. So thank you so much if you shopped and if you are interested in starting a business, you already know the link is in the description box. So y'all, everything I got checked off of my journal. Get your thoughts of a boss, babe. Journal 2024 is less than two months away. You cannot be slacking as a business owner. Okay, so y'all, I scheduled short, so I did so much. So now I'm about to unwind, go shower and stuff like that once I finish my Shein unboxing, which that's not gonna take me long either way, but let me look at what I scheduled. So y'all, I scheduled two shorts a day on YouTube. And I usually, y'all, I've definitely been slacking when it comes to YouTube shorts because I know like when YouTube shorts first started, I was definitely posting two to three shorts a day and I have slacked. Remember there was a point where I didn't have like no shorts scheduled. So today is November 12th. I have shorts scheduled to go all the way up until the 18th, which is what? About like six days, two, two a day. That's 12. So I have 12 pieces of content edited, scheduled, titled, and everything, you guys, for YouTube. I wanted to um, schedule some more, but I'm kind of experimenting yeah. experiment when it comes to content, and that's why I will never get when people try to copy what somebody else is doing, because just because it works for me does not mean that it will work for you. So when I say experiment, I mean I posted different variations of content, and I'm going to see which one does well on my page. So I posted a series of like just showing the lashes. I posted a series of trying on the glosses, the swatch videos. So I'm going to experiment that for this week. And then at the end of the week, I'm going to see, okay, which ones did good, which ones didn't do good and see what times I posted them, if that was a factor. So going into next week and the weeks to continue, I want to post more of the content that did well. So y'all, it's very important. If you have not been analyzing your business, what are you doing? So I scheduled that and y'all, why was I scheduling Instagram reels? And Instagram is, this is why I don't schedule content on Instagram when people ask me. 
I don't schedule. So I only have so far up to Tuesday. I actually scheduled all the way until Friday, but for some reason, when you try to schedule after you scheduled, it like freezes and it won't download. And what's crazy is it did the same thing to me on my personal page yesterday. And y'all, why did it post two of the same reels back to back? I was so mad because it was like, okay, which one do I delete? Because one had more views, but one had more comments. So I ended up having to delete one because I scheduled the reel and never ended up going because it said like, no, the internet's not working even though I have four bars. And then when I reposted it myself, it decided to post literally after the fact. So I do have some more reels scheduled, but I don't know what's wrong. And now they're still sitting in my draft. So the reels are sitting in the draft that I scheduled. But mission accomplished, you guys. I got content done for the week. So now it's just left to experiment and see what does well, what doesn't do well. So I know what to be posting going forward when it does come to my business page so now here are the orders they're all in bins now so y'all can't see them but like i said thank you everybody for shopping if you want to shop the link is in the description box i sell lashes lip gloss mascara lip liners so many different things samples are available right now what i'm about to do is just put my orders by the door i'm actually going to get my pink cart that i usually use and just put all of the orders in there i'm going to shower unwind um fold up my laundry because i was doing laundry today i'm going to fold up my laundry do my Shein collab and then i'm going to when i lay down in bed to relax and eat ice cream that is when i'm going to schedule my pinterest content but when it comes to pinterest let me see and i also do have to um order inventory so let me see my Pinterest, cause I did start scheduling pins last night. So as far as Pinterest is concerned, I have pins scheduled to go up to November 18th, which is Saturday. So I have pins today, it's Sunday. I have pins to go up to Saturday, but I still haven't even scheduled none of the content that I've recorded today. So we should be good for the month of at least leading into Black Friday. As far as Pinterest goes, I can't believe Black Friday is literally next week, you guys. Oh my gosh. Like, it don't even feel like it. But then again, I have said like, I know this year my Black Friday is gonna be totally different. This is about to be my fifth Black Friday. This year, Black Friday for me is going to be totally different. The last four Black Fridays, I kind of put my business first instead of actually enjoying my Black Friday and Thanksgiving is my favorite holiday. So this year, my Black Friday sale will be different as far as like what I do. But I'm excited for the sale. I'm excited for the giveaways. I'm just excited. I've already written out all of my flyers and stuff. I just have to send them to my graphic designer. That's why I'm like, dang, I should have been sent it to her. But I didn't know if I wanted to add more things because y'all know how I am. I just love to, but now that I think about it, I won't be able to get more appliances because it's kind of too late to order because I was going to try to get some appliances for Black Friday giveaways like flat irons and stuff like that. But when it has the rhinestones on it, they have to do that by hand. So it takes too long. So it's given we're just about to do lash bundles and lip gloss bundles because I will be doing a lip gloss bundle. I need to order that today. I'm going to be giving away a lip gloss bundle as well. So stay tuned for that because you could flip it and resell it if you win it. Um, but yeah, I got to order some inventory, not too much inventory, but just for the giveaways and stuff like that. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video of the behind the scenes of my content creation, a realistic day in my life as an entrepreneur. Let me know if y'all want more of these kinds of videos where I show you guys how I create my content and give you guys tips. And also y'all, I'm super excited because my bookmark came in today. So if you haven't seen the previous vlog, well, it wasn't a vlog, but I told y'all I went to Barnes and Nobles and I bought me some books to read. I ordered me a bookmark. So this is what it looks like. It says begin each day with a grateful heart. And that's exactly what I need because when I wake up and pray and make my bed and read, I wanna begin it with reading and putting knowledge into my brain, okay? So thank y'all for watching this video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Run up the views on my other videos and I will see y'all on the next one.